The Journey of Man, From Stardust to Civilization Chapter 1, Born from the Stars, Billions of Years Ago, In the Vast, Silent Darkness of Space, A Colossal Explosion The Big Bang Set the Universe in Motion, Stars Ignited, Galaxies Formed, And Deep Within a Young Solar System, A Small Planet Called Earth Was Born, For Millions of Years, Earth Was a Violent World of Fire, Storms, And Crashing Oceans, But in its chaotic waters, Something miraculous happened life emerged. At first, it was nothing more than microscopic creatures floating in the sea. They evolved, adapted, and over billions of years, transformed into more complex beings. Fish swam through the oceans, creatures crawled onto land, and the first mammals appeared. But nature was not finished yet. It had one more masterpiece to create. Chapter 2. The First. Humans somewhere in Africa. About six million years ago. A group of primates began to walk on two legs. They were different from their ancestors. They stood taller, used their hands to carry food, and saw the world from a new perspective. These early beings, known as Australopithecus, were the first step toward humanity. As time passed, nature sculpted them into something even greater. About two million years ago, a new species called Homo habilis appeared. They were smarter, more resourceful and learned to use tools. They hunted, protected themselves, and their brains began to grow. Then came Homo erectus, who mastered fire one of the most crucial discoveries in human history. Fire provided warmth, protection, and the ability to cook food, leading to better nutrition and stronger bodies. Over time, different human species roamed the earth. The Neanderthals, strong and resilient, thrived in Europe while the Denisovans lived in Asia, but around 300,000 years ago, a new species emerged in Africa Homo sapiens, the ones who would change the world forever. Chapter 3. The Age of Intelligence Homo sapiens were different. They didn't just survive. They thrived through imagination and communication. They painted on cave walls, telling stories of their hunts and dreams. They crafted better tools, built shelters, and formed close-knit tribes. But their most powerful weapon was language. With words, they could share knowledge, warn of danger, and plan for the future. This ability allowed them to outcompete all other human species. Around 70,000 years ago, Homo sapiens began spreading across the globe from Africa to Asia, to Europe, to Australia, and eventually to the Americas. Chapter 4. The Rise of Civilization for thousands of years, humans lived as hunters and gatherers. But then, around 10,000 years ago, something remarkable happened the agricultural revolution. Instead of chasing food, humans learned to grow crops and domesticate animals. Villages turned into towns, towns into cities, and civilizations were born. The first great civilizations arose along rivers Mesopotamia, Egypt, the Indus Valley, and 